Hi everyone, my name's Kirsty. I thought I'd start a booktube channel. I mean, why not? Everyone else is doing it. Um, my goal is to upload maybe two videos a week. I don't know whether right now whether that's not enough or whether I feel it's too much. I'll have to see how that goes. Um, <clears throat> right now I feel that two videos a, a week is good. I have two days a week off work, Wednesday and Friday. So they feel like good days where I could you know, get some chunks of videos recorded. Uh, see how that goes. By the way, I'm sat on the floor on a beanbag. So if there's any funny scrunchy noises, terribly sorry about that. I'm using my iPhone to record this video and I've not really properly worked out a good thing to prop it up on or a good thing for me to sit on. So right now, so I'm sat on the beanbag with my bookcases sort of to the side of me. I just want to a camera a bit wonky. I wanted to focus a bit more on the bookcases and just my, my behind me, my stairs, my door, everything like that. Um, I've got what I'm currently reading and aiming to read soon next to me as a prop kind of thing. Uh, and right now I'm reading the Mortal Instruments series. I'm actually on book four, City of Fallen Angels by Cassandra Clare. Um, about 118 pages in. I've just basically I'm about to start chapter six. I'm not liking this one so far actually. Um, I'm really not a massive fan of Simon and he, 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 too much Simon. Um, my goal then is to move on to my Kindle and then I'm going to read Clockwork Prince as I've just read Clockwork Angel before reading uh, City of Fallen Angels. Then I'm going to move on to City of Lost Souls again by Cassandra Clare. Then I'm going to read Clockwork Princess again on my Kindle. I love my Kindle so much. I don't know how I ever lived without a Kindle and I, I'd, I'd love this cover. Matches my lipstick. <laughs> Uh, and then we've got City of Heavenly Fire. It's a beast of a book. These books are making me behind on my goal. Because they're so big. My goal is to read 100 books this year and I'm really not sure whether that's going to be achievable for me or not, to be honest. I've definitely never read anywhere near that any other year. Um, but I'm buying books a lot faster now, faster than ever, thanks to watching so many booktube channels. So I've been on quite an audio kick recently. I've never tried audiobooks before so I thought I'd give that a go. I tried my free trial for Audible last week. Uh, you know we you get to download one free audible audiobook. So I downloaded um what's it called? The End of an Earring, that's it. The End of an Earring by Pam St. Clement, who played Pat in EastEnders if you've ever watched EastEnders. Uh, she's such an interesting lady. I love that book so much. It was absolutely fascinating. Uh, I've given it a four stars. It's probably more like four and a half stars, really. Although it's quite difficult to to rate an autobiography, really. I didn't really know where to go with it. It's almost like you're rating someone's life, otherwise. And, and I don't really know what to say, but I I loved it. I'll have a written review of that up on my blog soon. Um, I'm going to try and keep most of my reviewing to my blog. Uh, so if you found this uh, video, you're either watching this right now thinking, why did I click play? This is so dull. Or, I'm actually now, this is several years later, and I'm actually now some sort of vaguely successful booktuber. And you're watching my video literally just to laugh at me for how awkward I was for my first ever video, because everyone's first videos are awkward, I know that. Um, yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. If you like this video, please click like, even if it was just because you thought it was hilariously awkward. Uh, so, I don't know what to say. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye!